Max, could you have envisioned this going much better, especially with, with the, the, the amount of family members you had first game and two touchdowns? It was a good start for sure. Um, I had a lot of fun going out there and making plays with my team. I think a lot of people are already excited seeing the combo of you and James. What does it feel like on the field? Because to us, it looks pretty good. Yeah, no doubt. Um, me, James, and Keith, we're all solid running backs. Uh, we're excited. The rotation we got going is going to be real good this whole season. How do you, you feel like Gardner kind of moved the offense, uh, maybe aside from, from that second quarter today? It was awesome. I mean, he, he, he took control. He, he really went out there, took control, um, made, made big plays when we needed them, and uh, had some good calls. Talk about your second touchdown run. You had to do offensive line. Offensive line also did a good job. You just, like you pulled over a couple of guys too there. Completely. Uh, my offensive line had a, had a great day today. They they blocked like crazy, and uh, the wide receivers did as well. They made some big plays, big blocks, and then um, Keith Arrington made actually a huge block on that for me to open that up. And then I just went down there and did my thing. How did you kind of respond from, from from that fumble in the first half? And what were the coaches telling you? How did you kind of get through that? I just didn't even think about it. You know, you got to move on. If something like that happens, just play the next play. Don't even think about it. Don't let it, don't let it sit on your back like that. Do you think your knee was down <laughs> before the ball came? I, I feel like I was down. Yes. Yeah. Are you happy if your first game was played so close? Yeah. The, the, the only only two hours away. Yeah, no doubt. I had 35 people or so come up, yeah. cheer me on. So nothing like playing in front of people I love. What was that like having so many people, so many friends and family there watching your first game and having such a big day? It was awesome. It was like almost like I was back in like a high school atmosphere where every, all my family could come watch me and everything. Like super close. Um, it was good. How much, how, how much does it mean to you that, that you have a former team, high school teammate already committed to the to the Washington State football 2019 class? Well, what, what, what have you told Billy about your experience here at Washington State and, and uh, why he should come, why he's just a committed to Washington State? It's just a family here. Um, Obviously, Billy is a great player, and uh, I'm excited for him to come up, and he's going to make some big plays. What did you guys do preparation-wise this last week, getting ready for this Wyoming defense? Um, we've been prepping for a while now, just each and every one of us doing our own job, um, watching a lot of film and repeating everything in practice, making it all sharp. Anything stand out before you came in here that you were looking out for? Uh, not really. I mean, it was pretty, pretty basic. We knew what we were coming into. We watched a lot of film. And uh, we knew exactly what we were going to get. Last one. How, Max. Ma how many people will come for the Colorado game later on? <laughs> <laughs> That's a fun. I'm going to shoot for 60. <laughs> a lot. A lot for sure. Because I, I don't think the team's going to be using many of those tickets. So I'm going to get a lot of those tickets. <laughs> yep. Thanks, Max.